The International Day of World Indigenous People is observed annually on the 9th of August and in 2016 the theme was focused around rights to education. The theme is significant as Indigenous peoples around the world strive to have access to all levels of education and the challenges faced in attaining education. Noreen Dada reports on the rights to education for the Indigenous island people of Australia, the Torres Strait Islanders. August 9 each year is the day dedicated to the world's indigenous people. The 2016 theme is Indigenous People's Rights to Education. It's a theme and right protected by the UN Declaration on the Rights of Indigenous People as stated in Article No. 14. The Torres Strait Island people are one of two distinct indigenous groups of Australia, the set of sprawling islands scattered between the northern tip of Australia and Papua New Guinea. To talk about the historical relationship between the Torres Strait Islanders and Papua New Guinea, particularly those from the southern part of the western province, would take a considerable amount of time. So to highlight a few things in recognition of World Indigenous Day, I've picked a few notable traditional pointers, particularly in relation to traditional Torres Strait Island song and dance. All, all our performances are, are made through uh, stories being told about the land, sea and sky. This dance from the top western area is from Saibai Island, the closest island to PNG. The dance is depicting a broom dance. The broom dance is to ward off bad spirits. The first song sung in this dance is calling ancestors to come to the dance arena to protect the dancers and to eventually sweep off the bad spirits back to the world of the dead. An important part of the Torres Strait identity is the headdress sodari, an iconic ceremonial headdress. There are various representations of the material used to make a headdress. The dari, made of cassowary feathers, for example, is worn only in times of tribal conflict and is what warriors would normally wear. The Dari is, a, is, a, is an icon for Torres Strait Islanders. Worn, it, it can only be worn on the head. Um, the, the head and the star, they, they're the two main things that are on our flag. It's a national, uh, well, it's our icon. Uh, yeah, headdress can only be worn by men, not women. The star is for navigational purposes and symbolizes the seafaring culture of the Torres Strait people. The pointers on the star represent the traditional groups of the islands, the eastern group, western, central and inner western islands. Thanks, Noreen Dada, for that report. Well, that's all we have for you today. Just before we go, if you have questions or comments you'd like to make regarding the show, you can text in on 1623. Type in extra and add your comments or questions. We would love to hear from you. And as usual, the other methods to get in touch with us, you can email the extra team or visit the webpage, pngextra.com. Take care and bye for now.